Example 5. Make G, the subject in the formula, T, equals, 2 by, multiplied by the square root, of L over G. T, equals, 2 by, multiplied by the square root, of L over G. Now, we are to make G, the subject, and what we have here is G, is a denominator. Here, by the law of inverse, we have to multiply both sides by 2 pi, and since 2 pi is multiplying, it has to divide the t now. So, we have, t, over 2 pi, equals, the square root of l, over g. Now, removing the square root sign, we have to square the both sides, so we have t square, over, 4 pi square, equals, l, over g. We can now inverse the fractions, here, where the numerators become denominators, and the denominators become numerators. So we have, 4 pi square, over t square, equals, g, over l. Now, making g, the subject, l, which is dividing must now move, to multiply the 4 pi square. So our g, now equals, 4 pi square l, over t square. Or, 4 pi square l, over t square, equals, g, 